Dear God, thank you for waking us up this morning and keeping us in this new year. Thank you for getting us through the week. Thank you for having our backs, Lord, being a light onto our path and a lamp on our feet. We ask you in Jesus' name to touch those who have been lost their family members and friends over this past week and even before. Touch those who are grieving, Lord God. Let them grieve. And I ask that they don't stay in that grieving place for long, Lord God. I ask that you touch their hearts and soothe their souls and let them know that their soul is with you. I ask in Jesus' name that you continue to look out for the homeless and hungry, that they continue to be fixed up with three square meals a day, and that you shelter them, Lord. Continue to clothe them, God. Continue to send numerous blessings to them, Lord God. I ask that you touch those who have been unemployed for years on end and I ask, Lord God, that you fix them up with that job that they've been dreaming for. I ask that you fix that financial struggle for their families. I ask that you fix those severed bonds between family and friends and that the village comes back together. I ask, Lord God, that the world can continue to get to get along i ask for world peace lord god between all nations lord god cast out all petty differences so we can learn to come together as a people for what matters the most not the small things that don't matter lord we know that we're different people we know we have different personalities yet that should not be an excuse for us to not look out for each other so i ask that you bring the village back in this world i ask that as i continue to invest in my gifts and talents that you continue to use me to speak out about who you are, why we worship you, and why you are so good. Cast down every device that the enemy has over me and everyone connected to me. Keep the peace in every aspect of my life as well as my neighbors and their families and their friends. I ask, Lord God, that you continue to be a hedge of protection over the schools in Jesus' name. Protect all areas, Lord God, as they go to and from. And keep us protected as we go to and from our destination, Lord. It is with great honor and pleasure that we serve you. So I ask you, Lord, how can I serve you today? What can I do to be of service of you and my brothers and sisters what can i do to make you proud what can i do to ensure that i am in good standing with you continue to let me and everyone in the world know where they are when it comes to you prepare us for that final day that is soon to come upon us lord god continue to help us open our eyes when it comes to every device used to get us to worship Satan through the music, through the entertainment through everything that they try to use I cast it out I cast out all dark spirits of suicidal thoughts, homicidal thoughts anxiety, depression suffering low self esteem by faith, anything that makes a person feel like they are less than who you created us to be, I Slam it down in Jesus' name. I cast it away and send it back to the center because we are royalty in your eyes. You've made us fearless, fearfully and wonderfully and help us to see who we are in you and not to pay attention to what other people have to say about us. Let the only opinion that matters is yours. Help us to only listen to your voice and not the voice of other people. We know that the world is getting worse, Lord God, but we also know what's coming after. So continue to help us hold on. Hold on in your everlasting arms, Lord God. Be our strength. Be our rock. Be, help us stand on this firm foundation, Lord God, that we call the word. So we can continue to bring our best and our utmost until your son's return. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen.